Tonight we take you to Vixora, where city officials have decided to boost tourism by releasing cloned saber-toothed cats into the wild. It is erupting a species that has been extinct for over 10,000 years. We go now to our correspondent Sasha Riki, reporting from Vixora. Sasha. That's right, Jonathan. Despite being extinct for over 10,000 years, the prehistoric predators known as Smilodons are back thanks to officials and scientists who cloned them and released them into Vixora's wilderness. The decision to reintroduce Smilodons into the wild has left Vixora divided. City officials insist this is a calculated effort to boost the city's economy after several years of declining tourism revenue. Vixora is making history. As a mayor, I'm determined to put our city back on the map. People will come from all over the world to see real living, breathing Smilodons. It's a once in a lifetime experience. The science behind resurrecting these extinct cats is nothing short of a miracle. Geneticist Dr. Alan Norward, one of the lead scientists behind the project, explained how the cloning was achieved. We, uh, we sequenced the entire genome of the Smilodons and created a fresh copy of it. Then we integrated it into an artificial embryo and implanted it into a female tiger. While the science is groundbreaking, the reality is now sitting for the people who live here. The risks of releasing a prehistoric apex predator into modern ecosystems are raising serious questions, with some residents worried about their safety. I don't like it. I honestly don't like it. Have you seen their teeth? They look like daggers. I honestly think this is just another excuse by the mayor to force us into another quarantine. How can I go grocery shopping knowing that these wild beasts are running around? If the city implements better food delivery service, I'll be okay with it. I hate leaving my house anyways. I think it's a great move. Um, it will be like living in the ice age again. Plus, they look really cool. I wonder if I can take one of them as a pit. Beyond public reaction, there are emerging fears that criminal organizations may exploit this project. Authorities warn that Vixora's black market could soon see a trade in saber-toothed teeth, fueling illegal poaching efforts. Jonathan, while this experiment is being promoted as an economic boost for Vixora, it is clear that its full consequences have yet to be seen. A complex issue, Sasha. We will be watching closely to see how this unfolds. Stay safe.